want to demonstrate the glute squeeze, glute bridge with the squeeze. I'm going to move my mat out here a little bit farther. Okay, so we have talked about on my channel how important the posterior back chain is. We need to get that back stable, but first we need it to move properly and simple activation. That's where I start with all of my patients in the office is movement and activation. We then get to strength and conditioning, but we need to see that, that the low back and the glutes fire properly first. So this is called the glute bridge. I like to add a squeeze at the top. Sitting on the mat, feet about shoulder width apart, bend at the knees, lying back. Bringing the heels close to the behind, lying back. What we do is we raise that pelvis up, squeezing in the glutes, pushing down in the heels, squeezing two to four seconds and down. Pushing up through the heels. Now you may find that one side, when you do this, one side of the pelvis tilts. We want to keep that pelvis equal, coming up and down, just like an elevator, up and down. So if you have to put your hands underneath to gently guide at the beginning, so the glutes can learn that firing pattern, that's fabulous. As soon as you take that hands away, one of those sides tips, keep your hands there. I'll show you again. Heels right tight in, we push up. Hands can be here if we have this, that just tells us you have a weakness on one side. And down, pushing up through the heels, two to four seconds, and down. Two to four seconds, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze tight. When we are squeezing, we're actually activating that glute muscle. So, as I've talked about numerous times before, it's so important to get the glutes activated, firing properly. When the low back, as a chiropractor, when we notice that low back is dysfunctional, not moving properly, the muscles around it don't fire properly. Then different muscles get on the scene to pick up the slack of that low back. Then we run into vulnerability and injury. So that the posterior chain, very important to activate. I hope that's helpful. Glute bridge with the squeeze up. Any questions, ask me. It's one of my favorite exercises to really ensure that the glutes fire properly. It gives us strength. And then I can trust my back. I can trust my back when I go and do my activities of daily living, especially for people who sit continuously that low back becomes very vulnerable and the glutes are off the scene. So strengthen the glutes equals a strong low back. Dr. Laura Gravel, Campbell Chiropractic Center, 533 Queens, London, Ontario.